What advice would I give to people who are discerning? I think that the most important thing when you're discerning is to give yourself time and to give yourself space, spiritually, psychologically, uh, and sometimes even physically. Um, because to discern means uh, to sift. It's from the Latin word discernere. So it's, it's about sifting out what's true for you. Um, we could say what, what God's will is for you. And in order to do that, you need to take the space. You need to take the time for prayer, to talk to people that you trust. But ultimately, for every discerner, uh, a moment of decision does have to come. And so there's also, with the, with the time and the space and the prayer and the consultation, is also just that moment of faith, that moment when you have to step off the cliff. And it requires trust. It requires giving yourself over to people that are going to care for you, who want the best for you, and trusting that together, as you continue to build those relationships with the community, that somehow within all of that, God's will becomes known. And the beautiful thing for me is, as I have continued in my own discernment process, within my, the context of my own ministries, I'm being called out of myself constantly, called to become more, called to imagine more for myself than I ever would have if it was just left up to me. So take the time, have the conversations, pray, give yourself the space, but ultimately also have the courage to take the step.